Hey YouTube, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kia and you're watching Kia's Budget Life. If you are new and you like budgeting and shop with me videos, make sure you subscribe and turn your post notification for the very next video. So I do want to thank everyone that has been subscribing to me recently. I thank y'all so much for supporting your girl and her budget journey and things like that. I'm so glad you enjoy my content. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in to this video. We are stuffing $434 today. All right, so getting started with our bills. The first one we'll be stuffing is rent, and this is the rent for this month, and it is late. But it is fine. It's never paid on the first. I'm putting in $79, and it is a 50 a 50, a 20, a 5, and 5 ones, or 4 ones. I can't count today, y'all. I try something different. I don't normally, um, I don't normally have my cash tray on the right side, so hopefully this works. <laughs> okay. And my bills are right. What is going on? Y'all yeah, put all my bills in here backwards. <laughs> okay, so move this down. So my rent is normally $550, but this month's gonna be $540 because we did because our um, landlord has to reimburse us for a um something that my husband had fixed. So it is actually $510 this month. So this should be $510. One, two, three, four, four fifty, four seventy, four ninety, five hundred. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that is five, ten, and we will be going to pay that today, with including the water bill, which is actually I stuffed twenty five, but I actually um it's actually twenty seven dollars. So I do have twenty seven dollars in there. I just use some of my spending money and put it in there. And next is epidemic sound, which will be getting fifteen dollars. It's due on. The 11th, and this is going to be in prop money because it's getting drafted out of my account. Next is Netflix, it's getting $17, and this is doing the 14th. Also in prop money. And the final bill that is going to be paid today is the rental which is $202 also in prop money. And that is it for my bills. All right, next we're gonna move on to cash envelopes in my wallet. So I will be stuffing all of my cash envelopes this week for once. <laughs> so first is spending, I'm doing spending first. So spending will be getting $20 and this is just me paying for, um. My son's basketball fee to start basketball. Um, I think I stuffed it last month, but um, I actually use it for something. Or last week, I use it for something else. So I do have a dollar in spending, so I'm gonna put that to the side for my dollar jar. And like I said, twenty dollars is going into spending. And then gas will be getting thirty nine because I actually put I don't put fifty in there, but. I actually put twenty dollars in there yesterday, so I just put I'm just gonna put thirty nine in there. I know that, I know they don't equal fifty, but I had like nine dollars extra, so I just put it in the gas. So that's thirty nine, twenty, ten, a five, and four ones. I have a ton of ones over here. Okay, so I don't know where I was at. My husband knocked on the door. Um, I just gave him the rent money and the water bill to go pay that so um yeah 39 is going into gas so 20 30 35 36 37 38 hopefully this is enough for this week and then take out we'll be getting ten dollars so it's just a ten and that is it for cash envelopes All right, so now we're on our sinking funds, and the first one we're gonna be stuffing is in this binder, and it'll be household, and it'll be getting five dollars. I think I do like this uh, setup better. 
I'm right handed, so I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but I think I like this this way better. So it's five in the household. My son Mason will be getting ten dollars. So he now has twenty. Y'all can see my envelopes have changed. Just a little. All right, then my son Kobe will be getting $10 as well. Still got a ton of ones over here. Um, so that's 30 in Kobe. He was building up pretty good, but he actually needs a haircut, so um, I'll probably be using that some of that money this week. I'm not sure, but 30 into Kobe. In my envelope, I'll be getting $5. It's just a $5 bill. Okay. The grocery is supposed to have $16 in it, but I actually owe $16 to grocery. But we will be putting in $7. So it's a five and two ones. So there's seven dollars in grocery right now, but it's supposed to have it's supposed to actually have twenty-three dollars. So I'm gonna put that on there. I just have an eye of you. Y'all have some sloppy handwriting with this pen. <laughs> Alright, and then let's see. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it for this binder. I'm going back to. Oh, I didn't put mine. So mine just have five in it. Then we're going to my next binder. Starting off with car stuff. It'll be getting five dollars. Six dollars in car stuff. I need to start saving up for a for oil change. Six dollars. All right, vacations getting a dollar. As you can see, I owe forty-two dollars. <laughs> so I'm not sure when we're gonna take our vacation. I was going to go in on um, January, but now I don't know. So that's why I'm not, you know, trying to build it up too fast now. So that's forty-three into vacation. All right, and emergency is getting a dollar. Three dollars in an emergency. All right. You know what? Fun was in my other envelope. Let me go back over. I got these like all out of order right now. <laughs> so going back to my other envelope, I actually need stuff fun. So put a dollar in there. I think that's all in this binder now. Okay. One dollar in fun. Just all this in there. All right. I'm moving along. Got a couple more stuff. So flipping to date night. Be putting in four dollars. One, two, three, four. So date night now has five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven dollars in date nights. Okay. Then oh god, y'all, I got another one in the other binder, Kia's Creations. But let's go ahead and do surgery. Surgery will be getting a dollar. I think I just oh sorry. All right, so surgery now has two dollars. Two dollars in surgery. All right, now it's it for this binder. All right, going back to my previous binder, Kids Creations, which is my business, will be getting one dollar. All right, so it has one, two, three, four dollars. This is like a small business I just started, so 
What did I say? Four dollars? I think it was four. Pretty sure it was four. Then the last one I'm gonna stuff is Christmas in my holidays binder. All right, Christmas will be getting a dollar. So now it has 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. $24. I don't have a lot of Christmas to spend this year because we're just spending Christmas on our household, which is a family of five boys and me and my husband. So yeah, like he's gonna he got his own money for Christmas and then I'm gonna use that. So we don't need much this year. And that is it for the binders. And Christmas has 24. All right, now we're going to move on to our savings jar. All right, so I did tell you guys last week and probably the week before that that I was gonna get some coin wrappers for these. I never did, I never got around to it. Didn't get a chance to, but hopefully this doesn't overflow the jar because I have a lot of change, y'all, a lot. Let's have a giant handful here. I almost, I would say two handfuls there. Oh, wow. So, it's like right at the rim now. <laughs> Super heavy. As y'all can see, it's right there. So, I don't think it's going to make another week. So, I really need to get on getting those coin wrappers. So, I can go ahead and wrap these for you guys. If you would love to see a video of me uh, separating them and all that good stuff, make sure you let me know in the comments below. And I will do that. All right, so moving on to my bills jar. So I only have one dollar to roll over. That was some spending, so I'm gonna go ahead and roll that up. All right, so that's that one bill rolled up. One is better than nothing. Put it right in there. All right, and that is it for this video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and turn your post notifications for the very next video. Thank y'all so much. Have a wonderful weekend, and I will talk to y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.